Hello guys. So in this section, let's go ahead and build out the, the chain or the runnable that is required to build out the reason node, which is very similar to what we did in the reflection reflection systems as well, right? So I'm just going to go ahead and first build out, I mean, create a folder. Let's call it a uh, react agent. And then I'm going to call this the, let's say agent uh, reason, reason, runnable all right so let's think about what we need right here so all that we need is to you know provide all of the properties that the create react agent method is going to need so let me go ahead and paste a few imports right here pretty standard stuff we have the open ai chat model the, this is the method that we are going to be using the create react agent the tavali tool and you know we have the llm as well so what is the next thing that we need so uh, we can just go back to the first section and then let's see what we did right here. So we are still going to need the same tools that we have to provide, right? So we have the get system time tool. Basically, I'm going to replicate the same example that we saw. We don't want to reinvent the wheel because we're just learning, right? So I'm just going to copy, you know, everything right here, including the search tool as well as the get system time tool. So let me come back, put it over here. Perfect. And finally, we are going to use this particular create react agent method. And let's look at what are the things that it needs. So first thing is it requires the tools and then it requires the LLM as well. And then it requires the prompt. Okay. So the prompt that we need to provide is going to be the react prompt. Okay. So for that, I can just go to, you know, hub. Okay. So I can just say react prompt. Okay. This is going to be the react prompt template. I can just say hub dot Okay, let me just go ahead and paste it. Yeah, so this is going to basically pull the React prompt from the HW Chase 17 lang chain, you know, um, uh, the website. Perfect. So let's actually go ahead and provide this here as well. Okay, great. So it looks like this method has been provided everything that it needs. So this method is going to return a runnable, which is going to do all of those things that we saw in the uh, the slides before, right? So if I go in here, you can see that this is going to return a runnable. So we can call this the react agent runnable, let's say. Okay, perfect. All right, guys. So we have created the runnable, the reasoning runnable. In the next section, we are going to, you know, build out the state that we need to build out the system. So in the previous section, we looked at the custom state and we can actually put in pretty much any property that we want to achieve this particular system. So for the react we are going to need a few you know we are going to think about what are the states that we need so we will look at that in the next section